Hi guys, Wolfman here, and I'm going to be bringing you guys a Battlefield 3 update video for the uh, update that came out today. So let's jump into it. So um, the first part of this 2.7 gigabyte update is single player. So they fixed some um, glitches while playing the campaign. Those are the main things they really fixed in the single player, because well, really that's all you can fix. So they fixed some glitches and bugs within the single player, and then now we move on to the multiplayer. The stuff that they fix in the multiplayer are they fix like your your average everyday bug you'll find like you'll fall through the map or something stupid. They fix spawns now, so they should work a lot better. So you should no longer spawn close to enemies in team deathmatch or in squad deathmatch. They fix that. So if you're having problems with you spawning, I know I have on team deathmatch all the time. You'll spawn, it'll be a guy with a shotgun behind you and blow your face off. So they hopefully fix that. Um, they, they fix some audio issues where, like, you'll be swimming and then all of a sudden the sound will keep looping and you'll freak out and kill yourself. Things like that. They fixed uh, system crashes for the 360. So, guys, you're having those issues that should be fixed. They they nerfed the flashlight. So, you know how flashlight range was incredible. Someone just shined that thing in your face and it's annoying as hell, especially when they're on your team and they're just shining that thing in your face. You want to kill them. Well, they fix it to where... If you're more of a distance away, like the further you go away, the lesser the effect of the flashlight. So it's still going to be annoying if it's if that guy's like five feet away from you shining in your face. You have to deal with that. But if you get further away from the person, the light isn't as effective. So hopefully that helps with that. And with the weapons, some uh, it fixed like reloading and it won't show the reload animation, but it'll reload. They uh, fix that. That so just bugs and. Uh, just little glitches within the multiplayer. Now the most important part, which is the balance changes, which I think is the most important part, is uh so the most important balance changes that I can that I've uh, found out about is so uh helicopter miniguns, AA guns, jet cannons are more effective against infantry now. Um helicopter miniguns are more effective against Jeeps. There you go. Uh let's see. The 44 Magnum got uh Upgraded, so now it's more powerful. I couldn't find the word there, but you know it. it uh, you know it, it, it has more power, has more, does more damage now. Uh, of the 45 caliber and the 9 mil have increased range. Uh, also, with increased range, the P90, the MP7, and the PDWR have increased range. What else? Oh, so there's some range that was reduced. Was the MK11s, the SVDs. The M39 ERM, they were reduced, and a, a nerf would be to the G3 and the SCAR H, they were both. Helicopter miniguns, AA guns, jet cannons are more effective against infantry now. Helicopter miniguns are more effective against jeeps. There you go. The 44 Magnum got upgraded, so now it's more powerful. Of the 45 caliber and the 9 mil have increased range. Also, with increased range, the P90, the MP7, and the PDWR have increased range. So there's some range that was reduced was the MK11s, the SVDs, the M39 ERM. They were reduced. And a, a nerf would be to the G3 and the SCAR H. They were both nerfed the, the damage and the range on both those guns. They also reduced the damage from uh, the FIM-92 and the SA-18 IGLA missiles against aircraft. They increase the range of the 40 millimeter buck rounds. They reduce the damage of 50 cal weapons against helicopters. And they updated the T90 canister shell so it matches the Abrams. So those two tanks are equal now, I guess. I never really noticed, but I guess so. Also today, the the uh, back to uh, uh, Karkand map pack was released. Today. Make sure you hop on the battlefield and go check that out. So yeah, this has been the patch update video. I hope you guys enjoy. I should be doing more of these in the future. Even though Battlefield doesn't update itself as much as other games, so there won't be as many of these, but I will uh, hopefully be able to stay on top of them if they do come out. So I uh, thank you guys for watching. Hop on some Battlefield right now and have some fun, and I will see you guys next time.